Hi everyone, it's Lori and welcome to my channel. I hope you're all doing well today. So, today's my birthday. Yay! I've had a really good day so far. So, I thought I would just do a really quick video just to um, share with you guys some of the things that I did get for my birthday and to open up this envelope. Uh, now, if you saw my video on the entries for um, my birthday munch, birthday munch, okay, birthday month celebration I'm so sorry I should have oh that's somebody wishing me a happy birthday sorry guys so sweet oh very sweet um okay let's turn the volume off for a second um that's actually one of my ex-bosses <laughs> he's still with the company but he's not my boss anymore so he's amazing um but anyway if you saw that um hers was in the first video of the entry one and two hers and jovi's um but she had sent me this letter and her name is shirley and she had this envelope and she said don't open until my birthday so we're gonna go ahead and open this up guys been so excited i've been looking at it and I have reframed. You see it's still sealed. Now I have reframed from opening it. I am so excited. Oh my. I just got cold chills. Oh. Oh. How sweet. It's my favorite color of pink. Oh man. Surely it's beautiful. Oh. It says, when life gives you Monday, dip it in glitter and sparkle all day. <laughs> wow. Okay, is it a card? Yes. Hope you have a fabulous day. Love from Shirley. Oh, man. This is so awesome. Okay, guys. And Shirley is, I want a peacock. Uh, recycle, reuse, uh, rewant, maybe. What does that say? Oh, Lord, I can't see. And she is in the UK, guys. Wow. Shirley. Oh, it's amazing. Look at how pretty that is. Mm. Okay. Now I'm sniffling. It's so beautiful. It's just something so special about getting something handmade. I will cherish it always. Thank you so much, honey. Okay, guys. Now. Oh, let me show you this real quick. So this is kind of funny. So... Um, yesterday, uh, my husband actually picked up the grandkids. I had told you guys he had ran to um, Walmart and Home Depot to pick up salt for the pool and a couple of other things. So while he was do whenever he got back, um, Zarion and Jaslyn actually helped me clean out the garage some. And while they were working on that, I gave both of them a task. I cleaned out my car, <laughs> and I, my car gave me a birthday present. Look, guys, this <laughs> gym holds layers. <laughs> So, I can only assume, so this was under the passenger seat, so I could only assume one of the times shh, that I went to Hobby Lobby, uh, one of these must have fallen out of the bag and slid under the seat, and yay, thank you, car. Okay, so there's that. All right, so in this bag here, we have mostly from my daughter, but I think some from Zarion, because of course he had to... Um, get me something in a bag all from him um, so I'll start out by saying you guys know my kids are crazy you know they're dumpster babies so that explains a lot so um, by now most of you've heard of the whole fiasco with llamas so here we go so I have a neon scratch art book here llamas of course I'm not going to flip through the whole thing but yes, these crazy daughters of mine. Alright, so we have that. And we have Sloths Love Llamas activity book. So excited. Can't wait to um, break open this thing. Yeah, they're insane. Okay. And then we have a llama painting set. We've got one coloring panel, one paintbrush, one easel, four paint colors. Mm, I just do not know. And then we have... We have a llama phone stand. Yep. 
I need to haul them back to the dumpster. And this is alpaca, but close enough. This is actually kind of cute. It's my favorite color. I really like that. Just little, um, just a little stationary. So that is really cute. Now I do love that. So can't complain much on that. And then of course we have some llama lotion. Yay! That's going in my purse. Okay, and then we have llama socks. How cute. Yep, llama socks. And then we have 40 bucks to go to the nail salon. Cold hard cash is always good, guys. Cold hard cash. And then the rest of this, Zarion had to have his own bag of gifts for Nini. So this little turd, who may also need to go to the dumpster with his mama, went around my house <laughs> and picked up a couple of odd and end things to put in a bag for my birthday present. So of course I act surprised by them all. So we have one tube of possibly used cherry lip balm. And we have, I guess that could go on a bag of chips. Kind of looks familiar. And then we have one pencil. And then we have one dirty rainbow eraser. Yay! And this is actually new. So this is the Citronella wristband to ward off bugs. So there we go. So that was from my little Zarion. And he just grinned and smiled from ear to ear with everything that I pulled out. Oh, that boy has my heart. Okay, so we're going to put these things back down in here. Okay. Alright, guys. So, I am going to have to hop up and run and get the last birthday present from my wonderful children. And if you guys will hold on, I'm going to bring you out. I'm going to bring you down and I'm going to tilt you. It's going to be kind of a very odd angle for me. And I apologize because now my mouth is in your face pretty much. If it's loud, I apologize. Just turn your volume down. Um, I'll be right back, guys. 30-second dance party. Alright guys, I am back. Dance party is over with. So I would like for you all to meet. Now she was sleeping, so yeah, here we go. This is little Miss Bella. And she is the newest addition. Oh, goodness, guys, is the newest addition to our family. She's not going to get too big. Um, she is a mix. I'm not sure with what, but this little baby is why I spent two hours this morning and a buttload of money at PetSmart this morning on my birthday. We went on a little trip. Hey, Bella. And her name is Bella. <laughs> Hey mama, hey mama, oh, goodness guys, goodness guys, oh, what is it mama, oh, why are you scratching, you don't like the collar, no, hers don't like the collar, no, it'll be okay, 
<laughs> okay, mommy got you. Oh, goodness gracious. All right, guys. So that is Little Miss Bella, the newest addition to our family. So in a little while, I will be um, calling the vet. She is eight weeks and four days. Um, so I think typically about eight weeks. Oh, she's giving me kisses. Um, is when they start the first shot. So I am going to be giving them a call about us possibly getting an appointment for this Thursday. Because um, I know we little ones, all of them, need that Parvo shot. I have actually lost a puppy before um, to that disease. And it is heart-wrenching to watch. Uh, if you've ever had to go through that, you know what that is like. So, um, yeah, there's puppy pads everywhere in the house. Because <laughs> I am not going to let her outside yet. Not going to let her feet touch the ground. Any of that stuff. Because... If that parvo virus is anywhere, uh, she could contract it. So, yeah, the quicker we could get her in and get those started, the better. That way we can really start the training process. Got her a crate this morning because of the way that we work. She will have to be crated. Um, and, um, yes, I got a pink one. I'm so super excited. Yep, she's got a pink teeny tiny crate. So, it's amazing. Not cheap, by the way, but amazing. Alright guys, thank you all so much. I want to say thank you for all the people on Instagram and Facebook. Um, yeah, that have reached out to wish me a happy birthday. I really do appreciate it. You guys have made my day so far. Let's see, it's about 1 o'clock. Um, absolutely amazing. And I appreciate all of you guys beyond words. And I do want to remind you about my month-long birthday celebration. Um... Yeah, go over and check that video out. If I don't forget, I will leave a link to the original video in this video. And you guys can go over and check that out. And I hope you will consider participating. Because I am very excited about the giveaway for you guys. Um, but also about the donation journal. Where 100% of the sale of that journal when we auction it off will go to a charity that I have not picked yet, but it will be a charity, and I will certainly do my research, um, where the funds will go to uh, Ukrainian refugees. Um, it's just been weighing heavy on my heart ever since that stupid war started. Um, in fact, I had to stop watching CNN because of that, because I was just, um, yeah, uh, getting my head in a bad, bad place every day watching that mess, like hours on end, so... Um, I had to stop, and my heart was aching, and, you know, I think the Lord was just tugging on me and letting me know I needed to do something, and so I just decided to do a giveaway since my birthday was right around the corner, uh, and we'll do a donation journal, we'll auction it off, and those proceeds will go to charity. All right, guys, I will stop rambling. Thank you all so much again for the birthday wishes. Uh, I want to thank you guys for uh, supporting my channel. Uh, it definitely means more to me than you will ever know. I love you guys, and we'll see you next time. Bye-bye.